All right, we're doing about five minutes. Let's get it. It's so windy and chilly out that I'm already cold before my bath. So this one's gonna feel a little extra, I feel like, chilly. But today we're talking on, is what you're doing really important? And it doesn't even have to be anything huge, but ask yourself that. I feel like 99, like 90% 90 of the things that we do aren't really important. All the separate things that we do. Like for me, I'm gonna give you an example. Just, you know, very simple example, very small example, but in the morning, I have a choice between, you know, in my mind at least, I have infinite choices in reality, but in my mind, it's either kind of lay in bed and be on my phone, and that's how I used to do things, or go and sit outside for 30 minutes. Just, you know, enjoy the nature, enjoy the fresh air, enjoy the birds, you know, eating whatever they're finding on the ground. And that one thing right there, that sitting outside is so important to me. It's not something that I'm gonna remember in a year's time or anything, but it's something that throughout the day, I'm gonna be so grateful that I sat outside for that time in the morning. It just clears my mind, it clears, you know, it, I just feel so much better. And it's one of those things that I don't wanna trade that time for anything. But, <laughs> You know, a lot of us spend a lot of time, I feel like, doing things where they're just not important. Are you going to remember it, you know, in a, at the end of the day, end of the week, end of the month, end of the year? Probably not. And I don't think that everything you have to, but find things that you really will, because I think that it's important. Like, there's constantly going to be something vying for your attention nowadays, especially on, you know, your phone, online. Someone always wants your attention, your time, your energy, your money, anything like that. And a lot of it, you're not going to remember. You're not even going to, you know, on your deathbed, you're not going to remember it. I mean, maybe you will. It might be something that you're like, God, I can't, you know, I can't believe that happened. <laughs> or something like that. But I think that it is really important to question, you know, is what I'm doing actually, you know, fulfilling me, making me happy, at peace, you know? And some, maybe it is, but a lot of us that spend so much time, you know, watching shows or playing a bunch of video games, and there's nothing wrong with those if, you know, you're genuinely enjoying them, but I feel like we consume them to such a point that they become less important to us. Like, for me, I enjoy them less. Like, I, and when I watch a lot of TV or play a ton of video games, I enjoy them less. It's like, it's kind of, it's just... It's kind of like eating too many sweet things or junk food, I feel like. We start to enjoy it less. Because we just, we build up kind of like a tolerance to things over time. Like we, we, we don't get surprised anymore by like whatever the show does anymore or what, whatever food we eat. Because we eat so much of it, you know, and so it's such like stimulating either you know when you're eating you know super salty or sweet foods or like when you're watching your show super like pleasurable things for your mind and then you know we stop enjoying a the small things and b the even the big things aren't as enjoyable because we've kind of built up this tolerance to <laughs> you know what's actually enjoyable now and it's kind of like if you've ever heard about dopamine like you do kind of build that up over time but it's just, you know, we, so if they become less important, like it's okay to enjoy small things like that, even if they're not super important, even if you're not going to remember them in a year, like if you, let's say you spend a day doing, like you put in the hard work, you did your workout, you ate your meal, you know, you were you stuck to your diet, you did your work that you want to do, you did your learning that you wanted to do, and then at the end of the day, you want to watch a show. That's perfectly fine, but find things that are really important, things that you're gonna remember, things that are gonna support you, things are, that you actually enjoy as well. You know, learn to enjoy them sometimes, but find things that are genuinely good for you, not only physically and mentally, but just for like the self, the spiritual self, I don't know. But <laughs> that's my little brain, and let's talk. Oh, it's so windy out. That's what's really getting me today, but find something that's really going to be important. 
it doesn't necessarily have to be huge, but like for me, that 30 minutes in the morning, I would not trade that for anything. That is my time. I can genuinely say that I love that time. And I won't remember it probably in a long, long time, but uh, it sets me up for success. And so I hope you have enjoyed and have a great day. Bye-bye.